Howdy, my name is Captain Jeff Archer, and I'm one of the staff members who was lucky enough to be selected to attend the 2015 Texas A&M Corps of Cadets International Excursion to Georgia and Armenia. While in country, we got the opportunity to experience many exciting activities, including visiting early churches, monasteries, and temples, uh, learning about the geopolitical landscape from the country's leading experts, having the opportunity to hang out with local military academy students, and to experience the beautiful cities, countryside, and mountains of Georgia and Armenia. In this video, we hope to give you a small taste of the amazing opportunity that we experienced. And by the end, I'll guarantee you want to visit for yourself. While visiting Yerevan, Armenia, we got to visit the Caucus Institute. We got to sit and discuss with leading political experts in the country some of the conflicts that have been in the historical past of Armenia and also other countries in the Caucus regions. We also visited the Armenian Genocide Museum in Yerevan, which is a very sad place. It really got you right here. It was just horrible to see the tragedy and all the people that had died and just because of their religion. We got to have a tour of the whole brand new factory. That was a really unique experience. And uh, as we were leaving the brand new factory, you could see Mount Ararat across the border in Turkey and it's so beautiful. Tbilisi was an amazing city. It's something that, as an American, you don't often think that you want to take travels to go to Georgia, but everyone truly should. This city, whether it's in the daytime or by night, is lively, it's vibrant, and it's full of culture and it's full of friendly people. Uh, and I'm going to talk to you about the Georgian Defense Academy. Uh, while we were there, we got to see how the cadets live and how they're trained. The freshmen or the first year cadets got to live in um, these open style barracks uh, with tons of bunks and uh, a lot of them had all of their stuff um, neatly lined up. Their shoes were all polished. Uh, we got to see the progression from freshman to sophomore and junior to senior rooms. Um, they had awesome facilities, they had an obstacle course and uh, basketball courts and a soccer or an indoor soccer field. In Gori, we visited the Stalin Museum. We got to see where he grew up, what his house was like, and also the train that weighed, was like a super heavy train that he took around all throughout Europe and Russia. While at the Georgian American University in Tbilisi, we were able to engage and discuss some of Georgia's conflicts with some leading researchers at the university. It was interesting getting to see their perspectives and getting to see their opinions as they often contrast and are very different and it's very good for students to be able to see different perspectives and be able to really understand the conflicts from all different angles to be able to understand where the world truly is standing today. While visiting Tbilisi, Georgia, we got to not only see the beautiful city architecture, but we also got to experience lots of local cuisine. Both while visiting Armenia and Georgia, this local cuisine was something that we got to sample quite frequently. And in Tbilisi, we actually, a few of us, we got to go and have a bit of a cooking tour and a bit of a class of how to make the famous local thingali, which is a dumpling that is filled with meat and it's very fantastic and it's delicious, something that we truly don't have in America. I'm 
Recently we visited the Batumi State Maritime Academy. The students were all really nice. They had us pair up individually with a student and they walked us around the facility. Um, they have all brand new transit systems. Like we said the facility had been built for a year. Um, it, it was actually, it was really amazing. A lot of it was, it was similar and sometimes even better than at home. So that was definitely a neat experience. The trip we took into the Svaneti area was really interesting for the students because uh, they got to see a totally different side of the country. Taking that uh, trip through the countryside up into the mountains and being able to see those mountain communities and uh, really get a glimpse into how people have lived in the area for you know, thousands of years. <laughs> We got to stay at a beautiful uh, farm uh, that uh, was you know, set in a very nice valley and the following day uh, we spent uh, some time on a, an amazing hike uh, up into the mountains. Uh, so I think that they, they really learned from it, um, that they really um, grew. Uh, during, uh, during that part of the visit and uh, I think that they enjoyed it a lot. The trip was really an amazing learning experience in exposing the students to a variety of cultures um, and situations that they just would never have had the chance to see or learn from uh, in their education uh, in the United States. So they all really benefit, benefited from it and, and enjoyed it immensely. It is something that is absolutely amazing here in Georgia. Everywhere you go, there's beauty. It's different, whether it's mountains, whether it's caves, whether it's the morning sunrise, whether it's cities that are lit up by night, Georgia is a place that you want to come to.